Hey guys, so I'm going to be doing a video on this um, Korean noodle, Shin Ramen, um, which is from the Korean company Nongshim. I'm going to be doing a video on this because I've realised depending on what country the noodle is manufactured in, the ingredients um, are different from each other. For, and um, in this video I'm going to show you what that difference is. So this noodles, the noodles I've always been buying, I always check the ingredients before I buy any kind of food. Um, I'm very cautious about this kind of thing. So first of all, when you look at the back of the packet, you can see over here that it says Nongshim, um, manufactured by Nongshim and the country it's been manufactured in so over here it says it's been manufactured in Seoul in Korea and um, over here are the ingredients for it now for the ingredients it says noodle is made out of wheat flour palm oil potato starch the soup powder the soup powder is made out of salt spices red pepper garlic black pepper onion powder flavor enhancers um, sugar soybean paste powder, wheat flour, soy bean salt, vegetable powder, dried green onion, dried carrot, dried mushroom, dried pe red pepper. So from this you can tell that there's no meat products inside it at all. So it's so vegetarians are able to have this. However, I realized through looking at um, this website which is selling the same the same um, noodles, the same ramen um, from the same company Nongshim however this one isn't produced in um, it's not produced in South Korea it's produced in USA so this is the so this is the photo of it so when you look at the bottom where the barcode is it says Nongshim America whereas the other one it just said Nongshim it said Nongshim Co Ltd and it said Seoul Korea however this one is made in USA so when you look at the ingredients of it the ingredients are different so let's read this um, wheat flour palm oil potato starch modified potato starch salt contains less than 2% of each of the following Beef, so less than 2% of each of the following so there's less than 2% of beef e extract beef fat beef stock see so there's beef in the one produced in USA however the one in South Korea doesn't have any beef um, I'm just going I'm just going to read the continuance of this um, black pepper caramel corn syrup so it has all these extra things the other one didn't have like the one in South Korea it didn't have caramel it didn't have corn syrup um, dehydrated vegetables green onion mushroom carrot red chili pepper um, dextrose disodium guanlate um, all these like different kind of chemical sounding things oh yeah modified corn starch modified basically it's got this whole load of extra other stuff on it and uh, just, it just makes you think what you're eating really so I just wanted to point that out because that's really important because I don't want I don't want people to be thinking oh it's suitable veg for vegetarians it doesn't have any meat so let me just go and buy it with just looking at the front door front um bit of the packet please guys whatever anyone says whatever i even say in my videos don't just 100 percent based on that things differ where where what part of the countries or farm like me i'm from uk so what whatever of the of these noodles i bought they've always been um manufactured in south korea so i i had to point that out because um just even if you see people say something in a video just check for 100 percent just to be 100 percent sure so um yeah like it, when you see the other parts of the packaging is different as well the way it shows the preparation like over here the preparation is um actual photos then um like a cartoon like a cartoon version of it 
so yeah I just, I just had to point that out so if you are living in, in the um, United States check out for that so if it's produced in USA if it says it's manufactured in USA it's most likely to have beef extract in it so over here we're just going to show it again beef extract beef fat beef stock however the one in South Korea all the ones that I've had are suitable for vegetarians it doesn't say anything about it having beef and I really do doubt that they w won't include it in the ingredients because it's such a vital piece of information that it will be way too risky for them not to include it so i just want to point that out guys um thanks for watching this video and i'm sorry for um not having not having seen this before because someone commented on my um nongshim um video so um i found out through that and i'm very thankful to um the youtuber who wrote that comment to me and yeah so thanks for watching guys please um rate or comment subscribe or even check out my other videos so thanks guys um and bye